Hey Dad, I uh, thought I'd show you my power packs that I built. Uh, on this one here, I put one car adapter on it here with a, a cover for it. And if you'll see, I got a solar panel up here. And on the underneath, I put a solar, a little solar light that comes on and off with a NICAD battery there. Fully solar, and that will shine down onto that if you ever need light for that. And you know, in here we got the. Yeah, this is where you put the battery and uh, the car battery. You got your battery connectors. I got. Um, you know, I put in here a little one of these. Uh, you know, dual. You know, connectors. And I also put a little 15 amp uh, fuse on it. I've got some extra fuses in here in case you need those. On the second one I built, I did a double on on it so it's got it's got two a double outlet and um, this one this these outlets are on the instead of on the body like that one these are on the lid and if you pull up the lid you'll see I have it all nicely taken care of there and then I also put in this one some accessories uh, this is an inverter which you can plug in and then plug in a USB to charge and um, you know small appliances, coffee makers, that sort of thing. Um, along, also along in here, um, I put extra. You know, this is a uh, DC plug. That so if you got some DC units, you can put put that on there. So those are my two power inverters that I built. Uh, just use car batteries. Uh, I can hook them. Uh, the plan is to hook them up to trickle battery solar, you know, panels that are like trickle charge. I've got one of those. Those are cheap. It's just a trickle charge. You're trickling one. You're trickle charging one battery while you're using another. Or you know, I've been looking into getting like a 145 watt solar panel, which would charge these batteries also. Then uh, down here is my swamp cooler, which is uh, off the grid air conditioning. You've got a DC fan here. It's a car fan that plugs into one of these uh, units here. And if you look on the inside, um, there's a pump on the bottom. And then the hose that comes in and trickles water down into this felt type uh you know keeps this wet here and it's just continuous keep it wet now that's a ac pump right there like a pond pump i have um for about 15 dollars i bought a solar pond pump it comes with a solar panel and the pump which i will be using on this so that the whole thing will be off grid the pump will be solar and the fan will be well, we'll use one of these, you know, power packs that I've built. And as you can see, it's just a basic, you know, airflow goes in here, goes through the wettened moss uh, that's continually wettened, and then is blown out the top by the fan. And it should cool down any room by 20 degrees. It's a pretty cool little unit. I plan on probably making a little bit larger one of these units, maybe using something like, if you see this, this you know tote here use one of those totes maybe make something a little bit larger that works the same way and anyway so those are my little little DIY projects I've made and I, I agree we need to start looking into solar because solar is super cool and is totally doable and very affordable these days as well alright that's it bye